Welcome to another DTS support video. In this one, we're going to take a look at the differences between our single purchase Game Breaker product and our Game Breaker Plus product. In similarities, they both give you the flexibility of capturing and, and acquiring video from any number of sources, and they also both have the same coding ability to let you customize the program to your team, uh, your scout workflow, um, all the different avenues and, and areas that you can use video. Um, this code window, both programs allow you that flexibility. They also allow you to take clips and present them, whether that's putting them online, outside of the program, sending them to mobile devices, um, and of course, putting them on your television or projector through your laptop. So um, those are similarities from there. Uh, the tools for Game Breaker Plus are, um, go far beyond Game Breaker. Game Breaker is great from an editing standpoint. Um, again, a, a customized program around your specific team and needs that then um, allow you in a single location, our timeline, to present those clips. So um, you want to see all your shots. You can double click on that row. You want to see all your shots against to, to work on defensively. Um, bring up that clip. Um, that is the benefits uh, from Game Breaker for an editing. Game Breaker Plus really gives coaches a, uh, a lot more options for putting your video together and definitely um, excels at the analysis standpoint. So um, Game Breaker is, uh, gives you the merge rows option. So it basically takes multiple rows. So if we take our shots and saves, it's going to um, compress or, or, or put those two rows in a single row, view it as a single row, and put that movie together chronologically. So it'll go save, shot, save, shot, 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 you know, as, as they occur in the game. So for coaches that like to see only uh, or primarily the flow of the game, then um, Game Breaker is a great place to start. Game, or yeah, Game Breaker. So Game Breaker Plus, however, takes that to, gives you, again, coaches a lot more tools. So they might want to look at it from a uh, flow of the game, okay? Offense, defense, show how the game flows, uh, you know, by quarter or different section times of the game to see, you know, what's going on. Uh, it also gives you two more options, sequential and selection order, giving coaches, again, that flexibility for um, when approaching different, uh, different needs or different reasons for putting clips together. For instance, um, you may want to show just your offense, Highlight, these are our good examples, highlight in the game, uh, emphasize maybe in these three clips we did, your team did something really well three times and you want to show those three over and over to, to really emphasize that and hit that home and then show, again, the same idea with the settled defense. I want to show these three specific ones. So using our sequential rows, it'll put those, so they don't go chronologically, they go based on, um, they show you all the offense and then all the defense. So that's a great, great option. Another one is selection order. Um, different applications. One example is you're sitting with an individual player who comes in and is involved in these clips and you want them to see them. Selection order lets you bounce all over the game, all over different rows. And uh, so here we got clear ride, settle offense, and a shot. So um, again, uh, a lot more flexibility with Game Breaker Plus from an analysis standpoint so we can also then take that and uh, include that from a multi-game view so if we take that movie we created from game one with that individual involved and then we want to take some clips from game two because maybe they had a strong performance in one and not so much in the other game breaker plus allows you to drag and drop clips on top of each other so you can see i got my first section and the second section just by dragging and dropping and then i can drag that to the desktop um, if I put this together the night before, put it on the desktop, player comes in the next day, I'm ready to go uh, to sit with them. Um, prioritize that time we have with them. Game Breaker, Game Breaker Plus also gives you a, a uh, we'll go to combined timeline feature. Great tool for, again, if we look at um, either uh, one game we did real well, next game we have some things to work on, or if we have, um, it's perfect for a scout footage, so if you have a team you're coming up against and you have three past games, you've looked at them or played them, 
you can put them together. So you see we have game one, and then we roll into game two, just by doing our combined timeline. From there, then you can again have show all the goals that they scored against, that, that they scored on you, or all the shots that they're taking. Um, so building on the coding that you have, it gives you that flexibility of multiple, multiple game analysis. The next tool that is invaluable is a database feature. This database feature has a number of uh, different applications, um, but that, again, going back to giving coaches efficient tools for their different goals, uh, this database can be used is can be used for end of the year highlights, or at the end of the year you want to look at all your goals scored so that uh, next year you know what plays you ran effectively or uh, what combination of players work real well. So that's our database feature, and let's add some more to it. So we want to do our saves, add that. You know we're doing some work with our goalie. We're going to add those to that database, and you can continue to add to that throughout the year. So whether that's uh, big team ideas, big team concepts, you're working on a, a specific play that you ran are running this year, you, you anticipate running it next year, or want to, um, there, we have all of our saves. Uh, great for working with players over multiple seasons. So you have a freshman coming in that you see them growing into a more important role, uh, but they have some work to do. You can put all their season touches or plays that are involved into this database end of the year you have a catalog for them to simply come in with video look at that and go this is your off season what you need to work on in the off season or when they come in preseason the following year go okay let's grow on this let's let's develop this let's take video from a game by game basis and use it as a total video plan for our team philosophy and what we're working on that's the database feature so num again, number of different applications. This is, tool is in Game Breaker Plus only. So, from an analysis standpoint and a growing a team from again outside of a game by game basis, that's Game Breaker Plus. Well worth the investment um, if you're looking at it. So I hope this video was helpful in in highlighting the major features. If you have some more questions or uh, want to know maybe how uh, Game Breaker Plus fits these additional features may fit in your workflow or make a decision between the two, uh, just give us a call or email support at dtsvideo.com. Be happy to look at these with you and help out in any way. Until the next video, have a good one.